soccer. And as a matter of fact, we can see a little preview right here and see how nice that looks. Notice how we have the checkout here is in gray, but then our apply button is in the blue. And the apply button stands out much more than the checkout. So what we're going to do is we're going to switch the colors around and make the blue for the checkout and then the gray for the apply. So let's, there's a lot that we can do to customize this floating shopping cart. And that's what I love about the Yahoo stores. You can always customize to make it better. You can always have, you always have this like full control over everything to make it bigger, better, and just absolutely wonderful. And then when you're all done, go back into the manager, go to floating cart manager, okay, and then hit on the publish button. And what that's going to do is it's going to publish it and your floating chart, chart, cart, flo blah, 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 blah. your floating cart settings have been published. So now we should be able just to go to one choice for frogs.com and look at that. There's our floating shopping cart. If we go ahead and we add something into our cart, make sure that it works. All right, perfect. We've been sent here. And if we go back over to here, we see that we have one item in our cart for $5. If our client clicks on it, if our customer clicks on it, we can see that we've saved $5. We can see we have a frog jacket. We can see we need to add $95 more. We can see all this wonderful information. We can see for the shipping calculator. Um, for the state, we can put in Indiana, zip code 46530 and apply and look at that shipping is going to be zero dollars and my total is going to be five dollars and look at that I can check out this is a great way to increase your sales I love Yahoo they're always helping you they're SEO friendly and now they're really going to help you convert sales as well so enjoy the floating cart and have fun with it this is Shauna with one choice for your store and I hope you enjoyed this tutorial bye for now